when I stop aquí abajo. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. Welcome to Styling Realistic. El pitalabio que tengo puesto para este video is by Ella Masca and it's called Control. Let's get this party started with unboxing my first designer shoe of 2020. Yeah! I mentioned these two videos before and I didn't think I was gonna get it, but here it is, my new baby. Woo! Say hello to me, nuevo bebe. First, it comes in this gray box. First of all, déjame explicarle cómo this came to my house. This had the most beautiful packaging I've seen and I've bought quite a few shoes. Like I actually have a nice collection. This came beautifully wrapped. It came straight from Paris. Ay, 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 pero quien soy yo. Este zapato vino directamente de Paris. Yo nunca he ido a Paris. No joda nadie. <laughs> Straight from freaking Paris, I mean, imagine your girl having a croissant with an espresso with a fabulous leather beret in Paris. Este fue mi regalo de mi esposo que me lo dio para Christmas. So, vamos a abrirlo porque ya yo no puedo más. Mira que chulo. I know it's gonna be the naysayers, que no, estos zapatos son feos, esta onda son demasiado grande, bla 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 bla. No, look how fat this is. Yo me lo puse porque no podía esperar, so me lo puse el mismo día de crema. <laughs> Mira, ya están puesto. Le tengo que poner rubber on the bottom, but I love them. This is my baby. Número uno, comfortability. Fuck yeah. Segurísimo que están cómodo. Por eso que me encantaron más estos zapatos porque sabía que I wanted to buy or I wanted to get something that I know that I can wear every day and the heels not ridiculous. Los tacos no son incómodos, son bien chunky y gordito y como cuadrado. So cuando los tacos son así, son bien cómodos. Just by looking at them, I knew they were going to be comfortable. So see. Sí, Estos son bien cómodos. Número dos, practicalidad. Fuck yeah. It is super practical because you're gonna get your money's worth in terms of having a boot that you can wear every single day. Son negro, so it will go with anything. Se puede poner esto with skirts, whatever have you, and it's something that you're gonna get wear and tear up. Eso lo puedo poner todos los días. Y eso para mí es practicalidad. Practicality. 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 I put it on with nylon socks y de entre como, I don't know, I didn't time it, but maybe I would say wrap it up in media hora. They were super comfortable already. Adentro, es interesante. You will not be able to see this in the cutaways, pero adentro se ve bien, se ve bien gordo de afuera, pero los zapatos adentro, cuando uno se lo pone, when you actually put these boots on, this belt. They're tight on your legs, meaning like not tight that they're too small. They're fitted to mold your legs. So when you put your legs in here, it's not that there's all this space here between your leg and the boot. It's actually fitted to your leg so that the boot stays on your leg, but it has the illusion of this being like really thick and big and I saw it, I thought it was even better because I was like at first, like, hmm, how is this is going to be too big? It's going to be too loose. But no, entre la pierna está bien ajustado. No le queda grande, como que se aparente, como que si fuera grande. Did that shit just sound right? No fucking way, did I sound right? Número cuatro, el precio, the price. Okay, so this was a present, this was a gift by my husband. So he didn't want to tell me how much he paid for it, which makes sense. I actually didn't expect him to. But from the research that I did prior to even 
receiving the boost. Esta bota corre al precio de 500 y para arriba. When I made my wish list for my husband, because he always asks me every Christmas and my birthday, you know, they do what he wants. And I'm like, well, I mean, since you asked, I'm going to come out with a list. Con una lista profundo y grande. It was 500 plus a discount, but I don't remember the discount, okay? Esto viene en rojo, en negro, viene en blanco, viene en dos colores with two tones. I've seen this like with fuchsia on the bottom and red on the top, or I can't remember if it was the opposite. Those are the only colors that I've seen them in so far. Número cinco, a few tips on how to wear something like this, or really how I would style it, because for me, with fashion doesn't have rules, you do what you want, but in case you needed some tips, como yo me pongo esto, of course, you can always wear them with tights, like they're like the easiest way to wear them. Y si eres ni frío, obviously you put some beautiful big sweater over it, maybe put a belt on it, like some cool like streetwear jeans with a little crop top. This you can wear with anything. It just gives the look more of a streetwear, cool downtown vibe. And your girl is cool. Downtown type of girl. Numero six. How to store these boots? For me personally, I always keep my designer shoes, my expensive shoes. I always keep it in the freaking box. That's it. It's that simple. The best way to store them is just keep them in the box. That's what I do. So these will remain in the box. Simplemente lo dejas en la caja. 